What's good, people? Uncle Hotep back at it again. How y'all doing out there? We've got some good news for Syria. I think July 9th, in the southwestern part of Syria, they're going to uh, affect a ceasefire. You know, I think they're going to establish a de-escalation zone uh, in Syria. Um, I think I read a quote that Tillerson actually said, well, maybe Russia is <laughs> doing the right, has the right course of action that we're not, that we don't. You know, this, is, this comes off the heels of, you know, us shooting down a Syrian jet. You know, Russia said they're going to cut off the, <laughs> they're going to cut the line for uh, the calling, calling, calling in, you know what I mean? Like, they they had a line set up that, like, hey, we're going to bomb this place and, hey, so don't, so don't shoot the shooters down and stuff like that. Russia just said it. It was like, no, nah, man, cut that. Y'all shut down the Syrian jet. It's over. And they were going to treat any, any, they were going to turn, they were, they didn't say they were going to shoot it down, but they were going to turn on their anti-aircraft um, uh, radars on any flight, any, any, uh, uh, any aircraft over Syria. So I guess they, America was like, oh, 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 oh. whoa, this is, I mean, it's a whole bunch of posturing, but I, 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 I think this is us like, hey, man, we didn't want to call their bluff on this part. Um, you know, the Syrian conflict, it needs to come to an end. You know, um, this is the, one of the most failed. See, I don't know if I want to say it's a failed Western objective because some of it succeeded. You know, the flooding of immigrants to, to Italy, enemy to Europe succeeded. You know what I mean? Uh, that was part of the plan. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know, the, 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 that dark night, it was, was that part of your plan to get captured? You know what I mean? <laughs> Creating chaos in Syria, you know, giving all these uh, weapons to these jihadists and having them cause a, a whole bunch of refugees was part of their plan, obviously. Um, but I think their plan to get Assad out has obviously failed. Um, he, he seems to be a tougher nut to crack. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Can't Assad, the Assad. You know what? But, but you know what? Um, how bad do they want to get him? You know what I mean? You've you seen uh, our greatest ally jets attack uh, Syrian positions and stuff like that. Um, I don't think it's above them to actually assassinate a, a world leader. You know what I'm saying? So I don't. I don't. I, 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 maybe assassination wasn't on the table, or maybe he moved too quickly. But I thought I'd just seen him out in public the other day. So I don't know. You know what I mean? I think uh, it was like, like I said, some of the objectives weren't accomplished. It's, uh, obviously, the side's still there. But you know, where down Hezbollah accomplished. You know what I mean? Refugees accomplished. You know what I'm saying? And now it looks like they're gonna they're gonna make a de-escalation zone. I think they're gonna try to partition parts of Syria. I think that's obvious. You know what I mean? I think that's part of the plan. I think maybe instead of trying to get the whole kitten caboodle, they're like, hey, let's take a partition here. 20 years down the line, we'll try again. Take another partition. <laughs> I mean, if we can take a partition now, hold it, establish something there. Let's go 20, 30 years from now. Let's try it again. Get another piece, and then you know, what I mean that <laughs> the, that greatest, uh, the, the the greater project will, will uh, come to fruition. Um, that's it. But yeah, you know. Russia, I mean, Putin and Trump, man, they're getting things done. You know what I mean? G20, they ain't talking about climate control. They're like, yo, let's talk about this, man. Man to man. And I'm glad it's happening, man. Because a lot of dead people is it's happening, and, and, and the Syrian people don't deserve this. Dead serious. I, I, I wish it wouldn't come at the, at the expense of partitioning, you know what I mean? Because this is like, this is, uh, you know, the West partitioning. Uh, the Middle East all over again. You should let the Syrian people decide. You don't, I mean, you don't go from like way back then, you, you're partitioning and be like, 
that hey man we made a mistake man this guy wants this this land over here so we gotta let's let's repartition it again no man what about the people that's been living here all this time man, they don't got no say in the shit obviously not the powers that be the bankers do <laughs> you know what i'm saying it's it's screwed up man but it is what it is well let's hope this piece pro this uh this uh ceasefire works i think i think it will i think it'll hold a little bit um we'll see Maybe North Korea is going to jump off and they need a ceasefire in Syria. Hey, you never know. Anyway, this is Uncle Hotep. Yo, check me out. Podcast, Twitter, you know, Handy Mayhem, Uncle Hotep. Check me out. Please share these videos. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I greatly appreciate it. And if you did it to my Patreon, I greatly appreciate it too.